First off, we'd like to welcome everybody to the 2015 NCAA Division II Elite Eight here at the Ford Center in Evansville, Indiana. It's great to see everybody here this afternoon. My name is Jim Powers. I'll be your moderator all weekend long. Uh, what we'll do now is we'll just go right down the line and have the coaches introduce themselves to those that may not know them. Lon Reisman, Tarleton State. Joey Higginbotham, University of Mount Island. Joe Lombardi, Indiana University of Pennsylvania. Justin Leslie, Azusa Pacific. Blake Darner, Florida Southern. Stan Sparrow, Southern New Hampshire. Chad Walthall, Minnesota State Morning. Scott Davenport, Bellarmine. And we'll start right here with Lon. We'll uh, open up with some opening comments, and we'll just go right down the line. So, Lon, why don't you uh, kick us off? Welcome to Evansville. All right, thank you very much. Uh, I, I'm like probably all the other coaches up here. We know how hard it is to get to the Elite Eight. It's it's been a, it's it's just very very tough. And we've been here. This will be our third trip, and it's been I don't know nine or ten years since we've been here, and uh, it's it's very difficult every year, and and uh, we're just. Uh, you know, we're, we're very fortunate to be here. We, we come, we've been to a very tough conference and regional rate, regional teams, and uh, uh, looking forward to the weekend. And uh, know that we have we have a very tough opponent in Mount Olive, and we have a lot of respect for the team that we're getting ready to play tomorrow. First of all, just very appreciative of being here, and to the city of Evansville, the host so far has been great. Hopefully, we can stay around a few more days and uh, see a little bit more. Uh, but again, thankfully, like Coach said, it's you know to be one of eight teams remaining in the country. It's something to said for all of our programs, our institutions, and most of all, our student athletes. Uh, we're just excited to play. Got a huge challenge ahead of us against Tarleton, and uh, Coach has got a great team, great program, and uh, we're just we're looking forward to it. We're gonna play as hard as we can and see how things go. Well, I think that we're you know you really have to have a balanced team to be here. I don't think there's any doubt about that. You have to have people that are going to lead you differently every night, and I think that's what we do. Joey and I were talking about it today. That you know, there's a lot of us just don't have one player that you can key on. That we're uh, we're dealing with a, a very balanced attack, and I think that's what makes our teams unique. I know that you know we all play tough schedules, and if you look at our schedule, we went out to Vegas and we played the two former national champions, Western Washington and Drury. And, teams that we could have really went over to and went out there and defeated. But if you look at our scoring, we probably had a different person lead us every night. And, and if you look at our all-tournament teams, we probably have – we spread that out this year. We don't have the same person leading us every night on all-tournament teams and, and even all-conference. So uh, I think that's one of the unique things about our team and probably the teams that are here is that, that uh, we have a person – a different person that can step up for every night, and you really can't key on one person. Well, you know, we – First of all, we stress defense before anything, and we've been we've always felt like that's been one of the one of our strong points all year long. Is we want to we want to guard every day, and hopefully some of our the way we guard will trans, transfer over to our offense. There's no doubt about that. And our preparation, we take a lot of pride in our preparation. We've done, we really prepare well for each team, and and you know our team is a has been a, a team that is a really bought into what we do this year. They've they've worked very very hard. They've uh, they've been through. A, the Lone Star Conference was probably as good as I've seen in, in my, I've been there 27 years and I've, you know, we, we had some great, great players, a lot of Division One transfers into our league this year and, and it was a, it was a, it was a, it was one of probably the, in my 27 years conference was the best I've seen in a long time and to get through that conference and, and, and to win that conference was a great accomplishment for our kids and they get all the credit in the world and, uh, uh, you know, I think that, uh, that we're looking forward to, we know we got seven great teams here and, and I hopefully that's prepared us for what we're getting ready to go through this week. 